Hey, what's up, guys? So here we are. We're going to start off at the Bitter Lake. Shrine's going to be the north shore of the Bitter Lake. You guys are going to follow down this path. This is going to lead you to the first interaction with the Treasure Hunter. This is what we're going to do in order to gain access to the spell binder uh, spell. We first need to complete the Treasure Hunter quest line in order to access it. So just follow this path. Now, as you can see, as soon as you come up to the house here, the NPC is being attacked by three ads. So quickly defeat all three ads. Once they're all defeated, you're going to run up to the treasure hunter here and start to talk to him. Run out the dialogue completely until he starts repeating himself. Once that's done, let's move forward to the next uh, area to progress the storyline or the quest line. All right, we're going to fast travel to the Valley of Ecstasy. Now, keep in mind, in order for you guys to gain access to the Towers of Karma, you need to actually explore the whole entire map. Chapter 3 is a massive map, so you need access to the majority of these shrines in order to gain access to the Towers of Karma. That is where the Treasure Hunter is going to be located at uh, as we progress further to complete this side quests so just keep that in mind when you guys are exploring once you make it to the tower of karma go ahead and follow the path it's going to lead you to the treasure hunter as soon as you find him he's going to be up here freezing so make sure you have your ring of fire equipped you're going to use that ring of fire and then he's going to go ahead and walk into it to warm himself up From here, go ahead and talk to him and completely run out the dialogue until he starts to repeat the same thing over and over. It's better to do that. Just stay on the safe side since this game, often you have to proc the dialogue and run it out completely. Just progress certain side quests. Just keep that in mind. Once you're done talking to him, we're going to make our way to the Brooks of Bliss Shrine and just follow this path. This is going to lead us down to the water, the uh, Waterman on the Field Shrine. That way you guys are able to, you know, fast travel to this location. This is the location you need to access in order to continue this quest line. And this is where the secret boss fight is going to be held. Once you're good to go on the shrine, getting yourself ready for this boss fight, you'll enter the cavern and you're going to start the encounter. Now, this boss is actually pretty, he was pretty fun when I fought him. Um, this is the green cat marshalist. Now, once you get his moves down packed, he's, he's pretty simple to defeat. Just know that he does do a lot of vanishing ninja style type tactics, as well as using that. A ring of fire that he has and he uses it against you he actually weaponizes it against you so once you get his moves down packed you'll be able to take him out once you defeat this boss here you got full reign to give you access to that spell binder and then you'll be able to do some sick some some pretty sick builds with the spell binder uh, spell itself so yeah cheers hopefully this video helped you guys out if it did help you out, definitely consider a, a like and follow. Until then, I'll catch you guys on the next video.
you found this thing, I'll teach you a trick neither of them knows. Your hands. 